Yo, Lone Wolf, what's up, dude? May have just woken up from a nap. What time is it for you? Isn't it like 9 p.m. for you, you madman? Do, 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 do. You can heal when you go back to the ship, or if you just break down weapon armor and stuff, then you can get more Omni Gel to heal on the fly. Oh, yeah, I remember when I looted that stuff earlier and said, like, break down into Omni Gel. I thought there was something behind me. I was freaking out. I don't like this planet. It's scaring me. I want to go home. It's 9.30 p.m. Classic Lone Wolf. Alright, if they put in some more combat, like fighting that giant uh, creature, maybe not specifically that. I'd like some more small enemies to fight, like the drones we fought earlier in the game, but I can be pretty down for this Mako travel stuff if we uh, get more like that. Space probe here. Can I do any of this? Can I do anything with this? Salvage? Not electronic skill too low. Well, it do be that way. Dude, I really wish L1 was the uh, <laughs> was the um, run button. All right, get me out of here. Chat, do I need to go to the ship? Or not the ship. Do I need to go to the Mako? Because I know it's stored on the ship somewhere because we found it before. Do I need to go to it and like heal it? Or is it auto healed when I come back to the ship? Please tell me as I look at this uh, Gnosis system and read the rest of the stuff. Alright, this is the only one left is Gnosis, so like this doctor lady has to be here. How many planets we got? One, two, three, four, five. Five planets, five planets, five planets. I like this green looking one. Are many. Reminds me of Planet Namek. Armeni is a terrestrial world with an unusually thin atmosphere of Krypton and Xenon. It's crit we found Krypton! We get to be Superman now. Its surface is composed of silica with deposits of carbonaceous materials. The initial flyby probe of Armeni detected multiple areas at the equator with oddly regular surface protrusions. Closer investigation revealed these as millions of elaborate crypts a few meters below the surface, left by a long extinct spacefaring species called the Zaif. Many human universities wish to perform archaeological excavations. Council law holds grave sites as sacrosanct, however, and the matter has been tied up in court for a decade. Nice. Therum. Oh, this is where we land. Therum is a distant but rich industrial world claimed by the Human Systems Alliance. As plentiful heavy metals have fueled the recent manufacturing boom on Earth, core samples rich with fossils of simple silicon-based organisms indicate Therum was more habitable in the past than it is at present. Perhaps this explains the many Prothean ruins dotting the surface, most of which have been looted by mining corporations. Okay, so this is where we need to go. It does auto-heal when you return. Thank you. Zacros is a terrestrial world with a nitrogen methane atmosphere containing trace amounts of hydrocarbons. Its frigid surface is mainly composed of water, ice, and a hydrocarbon slush. Most of the surface is not solid enough to support the full weight of a landed ship. If approach is necessary, use shuttles or keep the ship's mass effect envelope up. Sure. Arcanus, a small hydrogen helium gas giant. Arcanus has been developed as a full-featured, if modest, stopover for ships hauling refined materials from Therum. In addition to a powerful magnetic field, the dump drive charge, Arcanus has a largely automated infrastructure of helium-3 refining and deuterium mining on its mini water ice moon. So I didn't survey, whoops. Survey that bad boy. Gas deposit surveyed, scans of this gas giant of, yeah, nitrogen. Okay, I don't, I don't think I need to read that like every time it comes up, just read whatever it gives me. Uh, do we check this one? Zacros? Do, do, yeah, we just read this one, didn't we? Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, this one, I think. Phaistos. I didn't look at this one. Phaistos is a small terrestrial with a trace amount of card. No, Xenon. I made the Xenon joke, didn't I? Or is this a different one? I don't know. Scurf the surface is scorching hot, mainly composed of sulfur and various silicates. There is a little, there is little of interest on this desolate world. I think that was all of them. All right. Therum. If this isn't where the plot is, then I have no idea. Population 34,000. Let's go. Give me Rex and Tali. That's not Tali, it's Ashley. Tali. This 
Sup? It's your boy. Oh, hello. This is insanely more linear. I love it. What do you need, buddy? Blisters your shields. Mighty Barrier will absorb up to 400 points of damage. Will not black, uh, black block attacks that bypass shield. That yeah, seems pretty great. What does stasis do? Stasis seems worthless. Shield boost. Yeah, fitness. Damage reduction hardening up. Get some more assault rifle power. And then I kind of like barrier. There we go. And then Tali, are you good? No, you got four points. Yeah, up your decryption. And then you gotta you gotta get good at pistols eventually. Commander, I'm picking up some strange readings. Really strange, like off the damn charts. It looks like it's coming from an underground complex a few clicks away from the drop zone. Look at all that lava! Hello? Is anything that I can shoot here? Would anything like to get shot? This really reminds me of the last world in the first Sly Cooper game. Where you had to uh, drive up to the uh, Clockworks Death Tower in the, the van with the turret on top of it and shoot stuff. That's a throwback. I love the Sly Cooper games. I wish the minimap at the bottom right actually had the outline of the area I can move through. Because I know that there are a bunch of, like, probably wherever lava is, there's, like, invisible walls. Because it did have, uh... There's going to be something over there. It had, uh, that's what it looked like on the map. There are some big red markers over there, and I'm a little spooked, not going to lie. Uh, oh, hey there. Oh, hey there. Yeah. Well, there goes that. Later, Geth nerds. I'm out of here. I'm gonna find this stupid doctor and then probably convince her to join my side or something. Was oh, saving content? Oh no. Only a fool punches a gnat back in the mouth. We should sneak around and pull its tail. Sure, dude. Whatever you say. Well, there goes that. Oh, I got a shot off at the end. Rude. Uh, help. All according to Keikaku. What's shooting at me? Where? Where am I getting shot from? From that way? Oh, from over there. I had it backwards. I also got a little stuck, not gonna lie. Hi guys! Hey everyone, how's it going? Fancy seeing you all here. What's up? It's your boy, I'm in a tank. Sucks to suck. Ah! Ah! It's fine, the shields are holding up, we're good. They have shields too. Ah, oh, they're dead. Go away. How am I not hitting you? There we go. Someone over here? Don't mind me, this, uh... This device can be a little, a little rickety. There's someone like inside the thing. I probably just need to get out at this point and shoot stuff the normal way. Other weapon. Where you at, where you at? I see your little red triangle. There it is. Rocket trooper, no thank you. Thanks for the meta gel. Ooh, easy decryption, don't mind if I do. I'm not using Omni Gel for this. Why would I ever want to pass up on this mini game? I love this mini game. Eventually, I'm going to have to learn when to start reducing stuff to Omni Gel, but for now, I'm just taking everything to sell it. Gate control. I'm going to be honest, I feel like opening the gate is a brain dead move because then the turrets can turn around and shoot at me. So I'm going to, like, I'm just going to not do that. Seems like a bad idea. Dive headfirst into the lava to test how lava resistant the Mako is. It's a really good idea. I should have considered that. 
Why didn't I think of that one? Nick, though, welcome to stream. How's it going? Glad to have you. Oh, easy decryption. My favorite kind of decryption. Thank you. Chameleon tool? Yeah, sure. Do, 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 do. This is dead end. This is dead end. I want to get to this other triangle and shoot him. And also loot more stuff. Take out those hostiles! <laughs> I don't know why, but the way she said that just sounded hilarious to me. Oh, the music's picking up. There's something to shoot! Hello? Where you at? Where you at? Another rocket boy? Nope, shock trooper. Not shocking anyone anymore. Too easy. It's too easy. I'm too good at games. Give me. This gate I need to open. Yeah. Now we can proceed. Let's go. Let's go, team. Let's go. I'm a genius. Let's get it. Now I'm just going to leave that other gate shut. I don't see why I would open it. Open it. Opening it seems like a terrible idea. If I can't somehow disable those turrets first. Which I don't know. Honestly, maybe I could if I poked around some more. Like, did I go in this building? What's in here? Maybe there is a way to, like, turn them off. I mean, there's got to be something that, like, controls them, right? Otherwise, they would just shoot at everything always. Is there a button in here that is, like, make turret explode? Oh, there's an upgrade kit. Glad I came in here. Good call, me. Good call. Armor piercing or radioactive? Oh, no, wait, no, I get all. That's right. I always forget that you actually get all. You don't have to pick when you see that. Every time I see the word upgrade and I'm given more than one option, my brain is immediately like, you only get one. That's how upgrades work. Pick whichever one you like more. In this game, you just get it all. Excuse me, there appears to be an invisible wall. Okay, cool. <laughs> that was weird. Get in. Let's go, boys. How does Rex even fit into this thing? Doesn't seem like he'd be able to. You know what else this really reminds me of? It reminds me of uh, the first Spectrobes game where you go to get the ultimate form. The first ultimate form Spectrobe. Also reminds me of that. I like playing in the Mako when there are things to shoot. Combat in the Mako is pretty fun. I feel like. Ow. Get out of here. I also love running over stuff. Are you alive? Excuse me, sir. Alright, cool. We got a lot of red triangles up ahead, boys. Oh, here is another ship. I hope it's not messing with our ship. Oh, there are a lot of boys up here. Oh, there are a lot of boys up here. That was a bad shot. Hi! Don't mind me, just running you over. Please die. Oh, I overheated my gun. Good call. You're dead. Hi! Nope. Excuse me, sir. Thank you. Turn this bad boy around. They just sent out a little rocket trooper to try and hit me? That's, that's so sad. Get out of here. I should have held on to that, like, rocket shot for a second. Nope, I'm overheating. Shoot, shoot, shoot. Thank you. That was bad. Bad by me. Oh, this is a Geth Colossus. This is different from the other things. I was wondering why it was giving me such trouble. Oh, I missed. I missed the shot. I'm overheated. I'm a fool. I'm a fool. There we go. We're good. That went way better than expected, actually. Not bad, me. Not bad. Well, well, well. What do we have over here? Is there perhaps a doctor in the house for me to speak to? Where you at, cowards? John John, welcome to stream. How's it going, brother? Good to see you. Chaos just run them over? The Colossus? I don't know. The Colossus seemed a little big to try and run over. It kind of spooked me. I like shooting. Oh, 
what do we have here? Bye to him. Here, I'll run over this one. You happy now, chat? What is... Oh, that was the body I sent flying with the explosion, I think. That's hilarious. Uh, well... Just over this way, I guess. I assume in these... Big, like these bigger open areas with like where you fight in the in the Mako there are not as many uh, there probably aren't very many collectibles that I need to worry about missing that assumption might be wrong but it's the assumption I'm going to make what's up fools I don't know if that guy got ran over or not I think he did Controls are a touch finicky here and there, but it actually, the Mako actually controls better than I thought it would. I mean, this game did come out in like 2007, so it's not like it's like ages old, but it's definitely not new either. And it's the first Mass Effect game, so. Don't fall in the lava. I don't want to find out the hard way if that's just an instant game over or not. Jammed! Oh, do I have to, I probably have to get out of the car. Doesn't look like I was going to be able to get through this. This definitely looks like a, uh, like, yeah, saving point. This is like a, hey, no ship past here. Or no Mako past here, I mean. Switchy to my, uh... Switch me to this. Ooh, this music. What is this music? Oh! Good hit, good hit. I love the sniper rifle in this game. Is that a... Is that a corpse? I can't tell. When we play Mass Effect 2 and 3, I'm picking a class that says it does sniper rifles. Wish I had done it in this game. You ain't hit me with that. What you doing over there, Geth? What you doing, buddy? Oh, pop back up, you dumb idiot. Headshot. Dude, I love the sniper in this game. It's so much fun. Sniper, best weapon confirmed. This music is sick. Anyone around here? Anyone around here? I wish I could zoom in a bit more on it. Maybe with a different one I could. Where you at? Where you at? Oh. Nailed it. I love the green effect. Is that radioactive rounds I have put on that does that? Dude, that guy dodged perfectly. Oh, uh, okay. Hacker. Someone was using his uh, lag switch right there. Goodbye. I don't know if headshots actually matter in this game. I would assume they would. What are you guys shooting at? Oh, up there. I didn't even see that person up there. Is there one up there? No. No. Someone shoot from over there, though. Nailed it! Dude, the sniper is just so good. It's demonstrably the best weapon in the game. The Mako driving was far worse in the uh, old game. They changed the handling. Well, I'm glad they did. Because it handles pretty alright. Is this the Liara mission or just some random exploration? I think it's the Liara mission? Definitely doesn't seem like random exploration. If this isn't the Liara mission, then I don't know how to get to the Liara mission. Bad shot. Hit him in the thigh. Oh, this guy's just bulky. That's a bulky dude. We all good? We all good? We all good? Yo, Posties, what's up, brother? How you doing? Good to see you. Oh. Yo, now that I have a gun that I enjoy using a lot, and we're getting into some more, like, this is what I was expecting Mass Effect to be. To be, like, a, uh, a kind of, like, storm areas, and, uh, or get into, like, uh, battle areas like we did in the, um, like we did in the bar, and then have to, like, have shootouts. This is what I was expecting Mass Effect to be, and I like it a lot. I'm enjoying the, the gun gameplay in this game, basically. Specifically with the sniper. All right, what we got up here? What we got up here? 
Music's kicking back up. I got people to shoot. More people to shoot. More geth. Where you at? Geths. Where you at, cowards? Where you at? I have been slaughtering you guys so far. Bring it on. Oh, 